Hey everybody, welcome to Stylish Grease Monkey. My name is Chris, welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new to my channel, please don't forget to hit the subscribe button, and the notification bell, so you know every time I upload a video, which I do at least twice a week, guys. This channel is about man's style and man's lifestyle. I try to dedicate my videos to try to influence as many men as possible to be confident and comfortable in their wear. So, speaking of that, my style is about heritage and my style is about biker style because I do ride a motorcycle. I'm not trying to tell you to buy a motorcycle, but at least you can get some kind of, you know, uh, understanding on what comfortable is for me and I hope you can use that. Now, we can't just be bikers all the time, right? We can't just be rugged or, you know, wearing boots, heritage boots all the time. The reason why I say that is because sometimes if we are with a special someone, they expect, there is an expectation that we also dress up much like they make an effort to dress up as well. And here's what I mean by that. If you're out going out on a nice date uh, with your spouse or with your special someone, there is an expectation that you dress up. And I know that, right? There's also an expectation that if you're applying for a certain job that you need to be dressed accordingly. And for me, to secure that part of my life, I dedicated my time in searching for the right shoes with my outfit. You can have the most perfect suit, guys. Most perfect sit, uh, fitting, expensive suit. But if you don't have the right footwear, it just kind of like erases the whole purpose of it. Uh, give you an example. I was walking out of my house this week and I saw up front, a little bit farther down the road, a man that was getting ready to go attend church. And I saw the wife. The wife is dressed to the T. Beautiful dress, nice heels, nice accessories, hair all done up, and of course, makeup. And then I look over to the guy, yes, he was wearing a nice dress shirt, tucked in, nice pants, nice fitting pants. And then I look a little bit more down, guys, square toed shoes out of the picture. You know what I'm talking about. Those shoes that look and feel comfortable that you can go and buy from the store because the purpose of it is for old men to be comfortable. I'm talking about 70s and 80s, you know. You know what I'm talking about, the sneaker feel shoes. Guys, that's off-putting, you know what I mean? And I'm not sure, I get it, you know, being married is dedication, but let's say that you're only dating someone at this point or only getting to know someone, I can guarantee you that impression will last in a negative way and you don't want that. So here's my, here's my piece of advice. Own two pairs of dress shoes, right? Put a little bit more effort to research and buy the right ones. A black one and a brown one. And I'm going to show you my, my two dress shoes that, I, that I've had for a long time and will probably have forever because it is a classic style and is a style that will never go out of style. So the first one is the black one. I want to go with the black one because the black one is a little bit more formal and it will probably be used most times when you go out. In fact, you don't have to have a brown one. You can always just have a black one and you'll be good to go. Now, this pair of shoes right here is very comfortable as well. This is the Colhan Grand OS uh, black shoes and in, the, in wingtip brogue style. The reason why it's brogue is because of the design and wingtip style because of the wingtips, right? But this is a classic look that will never go out of style, guys. Um, this, I've bought these shoes probably, I don't know, seven to ten years ago. As you can see, it is not used very much because I only use it on very special occasions. I've used this on job interviews. I've used these shoes to go to church. I've used these shoes to 
go out on special occasions, on very formal occasions, and it goes well, also goes well with jeans. If you wanna if you wanna do some kind of a business casual with jeans, this pair of shoes right here is my go-to. If you wanna own a pair of dress shoes, consider having the Kohan Grand OS. It's fairly prized, it's very comfortable, and the classic design will last you forever. Now let's move on to the brown shoes. For those of you that are wishing to own a pair of brown shoes, yes, I got it. Brown shoes are a little bit more stylish, you know, like European style, but brown shoes is also very versatile. You can wear brown shoes with any color suit, any color of pants. You can wear it with jeans, chinos, whatever have you. That's how versatile brown shoes are. Now, if you're one of those that wanna own brown shoes, here's my recommendation. Now you don't have to buy the same pair of shoes that I have, but I want to show you what I got. Maybe make that as a consideration for you to purchase. But this style right here is almost the same style as my Colhan, but this one right here is made by Taboot New York. Taboot New York is one of the top of the line shoemaker when it comes to dress shoes and formal wear. So this shoes right here, as you can see, and in the form in itself, it is wingtip, brogue style as well. It is made out of leather, beautiful brown leather. It goes with every color suit that I own. Whether, whether that be black, whether that be navy blue, whether that be gray or white or whatever it is, it is the go-to shoes when I want to be different than everybody else in the party. Or I can just go with my business casual, a nice fitting jeans, dark jeans, a dress shirt and some accessories, a nice watch or necklace. This thing right here is so sexy guys and I'm telling you, every time I wear these pair of shoes, this to boot New York, every time I wear it, I get all kinds of compliments from both men and women because that's just the kind of shoes it is. Anyways, that's just my recommendation own two pairs, a black one and a brown one, and specifically classic design so that you can own it forever. It'll never go out of style. Stay away, stay away guys, I'm telling you right now, stay away from two pointed shoes or shoes that are squared toes because, I mean, come on, that is not classic. I think it was a hit in the 1990s or maybe even in the late 1990s, but that train has left a long time ago. If you wanna, if you wanna buy comfortable shoes, get something that's a classic in design so you can keep it forever, right? That's just my recommendation. My style is subjective. That's how I see it. I am trying to uh, share it with you so you can get an idea on what you're going to do when it comes to pairs of uh, dress shoes. Now, I own other pairs of dress shoes as well, but these are my two main ones. That is all I have for you today. I hope you enjoyed that video and you got something out of it. Again, please, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. Also, leave me a like. YouTube algorithm loves that. And then if you leave me a like, the more likes it, the video have, the more it will be shared in the YouTube world and then we can grow this channel together. If you have recommendations on what type of video you would like to see from me, leave a comment under the comment section below. I would love to engage with you. I do appreciate it. Until next time.